let us do a lab activity for finding the surface area of a right circular cylinder. Click each tab to know more. The objective of this activity is to obtain the formula for the curved and total surface area of a right circular cylinder in terms of radius or of its base and height h. The materials required are rectangular sheet of cardboard, colored papers, pair of scissors, geometry box, cello tape and pencil. Cut a rectangular sheet of cardboard of length L and breadth H. Make a curve by gently folding the sheet such that two sides of lengths come together. Join the edges by using a cello tape. Thus, we obtain a right circular cylinder without bases. As we already know that the lateral surface area excludes the top and the bottom surfaces. So here, the area of rectangle will be equal to the curved surface area of the cylinder. And the height of cylinder is equal to breadth of the rectangle and circumference of the base is equal to the length of the rectangle. Thus, the curved surface area of the cylinder is equal to the area of the rectangle. That is, length into breadth equal to 2 pi r into h equal to 2 pi r h. Now, draw two circles of the same radius r on colored sheets and cut them out. Join each of the circular sheets on the two ends of the cylinder as shown. Then the total surface area of the cylinder is equal to the sum of the curved surface area, areas of top and bottom surfaces. The base and top of the cylinder are congruent circles. The lateral surface of the cylinder opens to form a rectangle. The length of the rectangle is equal to circumference of the circular base that is 2 pi r. The total surface area of the cylinder is the sum of area of the two circular ends and the curved surface area. Curved surface area of the cylinder is equal to the area of the rectangle that is 2 pi r h. The total surface area of the cylinder is equal to the sum of the area of the lateral surface and the areas of two circular ends of the cylinder.